All right, so springtime is here officially. Some warm weather has rolled in. Where I'm at, it was snowing like a few weeks ago. So I've been waiting for this type of weather. It really is one of my favorite times of the year. So in this video, I have four lightweight jackets that are perfect for spring to show you guys a pair of sneakers and then a couple pairs of shorts. So a lot to do, gotta jump right into it. Starting things off with the jacket that I'm wearing. This is a lightweight bomber jacket in black. It is done in a cotton twill. Probably the most lightweight bomber jacket that I have. And the problem with a lot of these style jackets is they're usually cheap and not constructed very well. That is not the case with this. It has a mesh inner lining. The material is super soft and water resistant. Two front pockets and a sturdy zipper. Nothing that's gonna get snagged. So a very simple bomber jacket design. I will link it down below and they also offer it in navy. So one of my favorite colors for the springtime is blue. A lot of people go with pastels, like a light green, a light orange, a light yellow. I like blue just like the Royal Ones, different shades of blue look really nice, like these True Blues and then these new patent leather 11 Lows. So to go with those sneakers, a lot of the jackets I've been looking for are also blue. So sticking with that same theme, I got a blue coach's jacket from Everlane as well. This is a polyester jacket, lightweight, just like all the jackets I'm gonna show you are. It's got a button front closure, two front pockets, and then some traditional drawstrings down at the bottom. Just like this bomber jacket, the construction of this coach's jacket is done very well. It does not feel like a cheap jacket, which is always nice. You don't really wanna feel like you're wearing something cheap. This feels like a high quality designer jacket, but you don't pay that price. There's two things that sold me on this coat. One, the color. I don't have anything like this, so that immediately draws me in. And then two, the fit. A lot of coaches' jackets are longer length. Not this one, this is a very traditional length. And the reason why I like that is so that I can layer. So my t-shirt hangs lower than the jacket. A lot of times with coaches jackets, the t-shirt is underneath it. That's not the look I wanted to go for with this. It really gives off that layering effect. So I went ahead and grabbed it. I will link it down below as well. All right, getting into a pair of kicks. We got a new pair of Jordans and I've had these for a few weeks now. They were sent to me from Rise New York and I never showed them to you. There's actually two pairs. This is one of them. I'm saving the second pair for another video, but these are kind of a sleeper, man. These are kind of a sleeper. And here we go with the Air Jordan 8 alternate. So these are a really nice shoe, definitely clean in person. I gotta say this right from the jump, the leather quality could have been a little bit better, but that's to be desired from a lot of Jordan retros. You guys know the deal. If you can look past that, you've got a really nice Jordan retro for the summertime. Let me know down in the comment section what you guys think about these. I feel like they were overlooked because this is a pretty solid shoe. Aside from the leather quality, the colorway is on point, and this is something I can see myself rocking with some high cut white socks or some black denim, whatever it is. I like the eights, man. I like the eights a lot. We gotta keep it moving though, so big shout out to Rise. All right, so the next two jackets that I'm gonna show you are straight fire. Straight fire. Check this joint out, man. Check this joint out. We got a windbreaker from Champion that is reversible. And I saw this and I, was, I couldn't click the mouse fast enough. I grabbed it from overseas. I haven't seen anywhere in the States that has this jacket and it drew me right in. I'll try to link it down below. Not sure if it's sold out or not yet. This thing is perfect for this time of year. So I was drawn in like a tractor beam when I saw this. You've got some nice color blocking on here. Up top is the blue and then down below is the red. A nice sturdy zipper going down the middle and then three front pockets. You've got an additional one up there on the left side of the chest. You have a champion logo on the left arm and then probably the best part I'd say is the inner line Lining is all champion straight champion logo in there and it is actually reversible I probably won't wear it like that because that's super flashy and not really my style but you see the detail and you see the logo on the inner lining of the jacket when you wear it like this so that really sold me and I think it's super unique something like this I really wanted to add to my closet because it's a step up 
from the normal champion stuff, but it's still not a collab, so it's attainable. It's right around that $100 price point. So I will link this down below, Champion Windbreaker. All right, so this next pickup is the nicest jacket I've ever bought. Think about that. I've shown a lot of jackets on this channel, probably over 50. This is easily the best one I've ever added to my closet. This thing is crazy. Like, it is so nice. I, I can't even really describe it. I'm not going to do a very good job of describing it, but I'm very excited to share it with you guys and to rock it. I can't wait to throw this thing on. It just showed up the other day. So here we go with the Ame Leondor Nylon Windbreaker from their most recent spring collection. And when I tell you guys that this joint is crazy, I'm not lying. It is easily the best jacket that I've ever bought. I can't wait to wear this. I want to wear this thing every single day. For one, look how nice the color blocking is on here. It looks perfect. I love how they did the light blue with the navy top and then the off-white bottom. This is such a killer combination. And then on top of it all, it's done in that track jacket style. So there's no hood, you've got a high cut collar and then a gold zipper going down the entire joint. The quality and craftsmanship of this jacket is next level, as it should be. It's a designer jacket, retail price is 400. I paid 300, which is still an awful lot to pay for a jacket, but people buy $150 Supreme windbreakers for like 500, which is always crazy to me, but that's a whole nother story. This is a New York based brand, if you're unfamiliar with them, and the material is a nylon Oxford. I've never really felt anything like it. It's super soft. The inside is an off-white mesh to kind of match the bottom of the jacket. You gotta see this thing in person to really appreciate it. Video is not gonna do it justice. So I was really excited about that champion jacket until I got this in. I really don't wanna wear anything else but this. So you're gonna be seeing me rock this very often. Ame Leondor is in like the same category as John Elliott is. So that type of price range and quality is what you're gonna expect if you wanna shop on that level. And I'm not gonna be copping too much stuff from them after I broke the bank on this. We'll see what they offer in the fall, but definitely a very cool brand that you guys should check out if you wanna step up your closet a little bit. Next up, I got two pairs of Champion shorts. These are some gold mesh joints that are like $10, like 15 bucks. I forget what the price is on these. I got them at an outlet, and this is actually my second pair. The first one, I got it stuck on like a bench, and then they ripped up. These are actually perfect for the summer because they're so lightweight there's nothing to them it's just mesh and then a classic champion C and then next up these are the varsity joints that have a little bit thicker of a mesh more of a construction feel and then a varsity type finish on the bottom and on the waistband you do have the classic C on the left side and there's pockets with these so definitely a nicer short and this type of style is something that I'm gonna be wearing a lot this summer I want to get the Mitchell and Ness Orlando Magic and the Bulls joints but those are pretty pricey at 125 bucks just for some shorts that you're gonna be wearing in the summer or spring so we'll see what happens there I might just get the Adidas joints but I'm gonna wrap up this video here. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Definitely hit that thumbs up if you did. Subscribe if you're new. Follow me on Twitter, Instagram, and Snapchat. It's all Eddie Wynn Kicks. A lot of new stuff on the way. Go check out my older videos if you miss them. I'm doing a giveaway on these joints with Champ Sports, so if you missed that video, go check it out. I will catch you guys on the next one. I'm going to wear this right friggin' now. I'll talk to you guys later. Peace. <laughs>